It's a cut. I'm pretty sure with a take. What up, Minus? I missed the flower? That one is not the one. This one is not the one. This one is the one. Next to the take. Can't really stop AOEs here, so just everyone attack. To double check that actually because I don't think there was one there. I didn't see it, but then again, I am blind. Easy way to check at least. The flower would not be active from that side, and yep, you were right. Thank you for pointing that out. I just I missed it then. I completely was blind on it. one we can't go into yet. Same fight again. All right. And then shock arms. <laughs> Then, uh, yeah, just keep attacking. We don't need to use any more TP right now. As long as we leave the one plant on its own, we... Ah, that's an issue. I wish Ilya attacked faster, but all right. As long as the plant on its own, it's not as much of a threat. All I can do is bind our arms and hurt one person. That's nowhere near as damaging as some of the other stuff that we can deal with. Alright, now Motor will give passive heals. Actually, I could just auto at this point. <laughs> yeah, we can play Risky because we have March at level 3 right now. And Kokaitis! Look at you! Oh, smug and leveling up. All right. So, are you still here, Midori? If you are, we will go with what you have here. If not, I will resort to... Actually, I don't even think you gave me one, did you? 
That was for Demi with the farmer. That was Giltrol. I don't think. Oh no, Midori did give me something right. No, you didn't. That was someone else. That's right in the rest of life there. Damn it. Um, is Midori around then? Let me see. It looks like they are not in chat anymore, I think. They're not showing up in the, uh, in the user list, though, unfortunately. Shit. I have to find if they said, I, I think they sent me one somewhere, right? No, that's Beast. That's Demi. Ilya. Danger Fangs. Uh, what's it called? Ronin. That was Zeno's kill troll. No, I don't think Midori sent me one at all. Well, fuck. You know what that means, guys? If Midori sent me no guidance whatsoever, and I there was nothing written down for her, we just can't. <laughs> we just can't use a skill point for them because they don't have to decide all that stuff. Bakata. Yeah, it's only one point. When it goes to two or three, then we have an issue. And yep, this is a take place. Because it's using the take skill. Yeah, Crumpled sap and cross seed. Thank God. New item though, crumpled sap. Super Snail, how's it going? Welcome. I mean, it's getting to the point of, uh, where some skills do take multiple points anyways. True. And we can stockpile that. That's going to be not a problem at all. Or at least not as much of a problem. There's a door. The ambient chirping of birds and insects fills the air. Suddenly, a group of soldiers appear. Konnichiwa. Good to see you. We've been sent directly from HQ. One of the tense looking soldiers speaks to you. In light of recent events, HQ is looking for some capable adventurers. If you think you're up to the task, be sure to pay them a visit. The soldier delivers the message, then bows. Perhaps you should stop by HQ the next time you're in town. All right. Until I got until I got to level 20, I haven't spent a point after 11, so you can do it, Rep. There's a key difference between you and me, Angelo. One, you know what this game is. You understand enemies and all that stuff. I'm playing this blind. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Second, you made your team. You can actually manufacture good synergy. I'm playing with whatever the fuck Jack gave me. So inherently, we're having rather different experiences. Not today, Satan. Not today, Satan. I will not. For any fucking reason. Endure three fights. Fuck you, game. Okay, you're wrong. Everything, everything, including things that we didn't even know of yet, could go wrong. All right, so it's like that. Is one fight with three. That's still a hard fucking no, dog. 
Oh hell. Oh hell. Oh, this is bad. Oh, this is fucking bad. We gotta kill these slimes fucking fast. Okay, I'm hoping to get poison on her or something. Cause he said yes today. <laughs> Damn it, Harko went next. So unfortunately, the big damage missed out. Motorum was hit, of course. That taunt means nothing. Don't do that. Do guard order on the front. It's a heal for them. Fuck. I was hoping that was going to be enough, but no, it's not. I think I'm just going to avoid all damage from the turn so I can try to heal people. Back. I'm even gonna use force for you yeah. to give us an attack or er, guard order actually for everyone. No longer have a taunt or our fire buff. All right, we're back on top, but we've unfortunately lost the tanks. Force break. We should be okay, but I'm very nervous. To me, this is just normal ass tree right here. It's furthermore just a standard encounter can cause so much to go wrong. If it's a combination with anything else, even. Mio, that's Zeno Parasite, I believe. So, are you here, man? If not, I'm gonna go with whatever you wrote down here. I'll get my D4 ready. I'm gonna watch for the. Oh, I bet. I bet. Tragedy. I don't doubt that in the slightest. 
I'm pretty sure that foe is one of them. Alright. I guess he may not be here then. Let me double check the view the viewer list just to make sure. No, apparently his name is in chat. I'll give him a little a little bit right here. Dental Parasites, if you are that around, please. Where do you want to use this? If not, I'm going to default to what you gave me before, which is not labeled. It's just skills you want. Tone again? All right. Thank you for ch uh, chirping up. All right. Yes! Better healing rate. And then the next upgrade is going to be the one that's going to cost, increase the cost of that skill. A two square in front of us. Blue. All right. And here is three reds. With one to the right over there. One blue pond right here. Two spaces in front of me is a red. The green right here. I'm not going to walk that way, though. Blue. Huh. And a chest, though. I kind of want that chest, but I don't want to have to... Ow. Alright. This is a red right here. A one square red, though, thankfully. Alright, we should... Oh, yeah, we already recovered most of that HP already. No event there. Game! Game, please! <laughs> Enough of this bullshit! Game saying need guns and survivalists. Well, guess what? Nobody in chat wanted to be one. <laughs> yeah, that's the thing. People, people who want these um, uh, characters need to win a raffle. Everyone that's wanted to raffle wanted to be other classes. Why wow, we got two pugilists and two harbingers? <laughs> you like slimes and palm trees? No, I don't. <laughs> How's it going up that coffee? Welcome to the stream. I'm just gonna keep on war healing uh, Motor. I'm scared that she will get screwed over, hit, and then we're not gonna get our passive heals. <laughs> Watch, I. It's not happened. So I'm going to attack with Motorm, and the moment I do, that Palm Tree is going to AoE attack, and it's going to put us all on the back foot. Uh -huh. 
There's so many classes though. Which ones haven't been fixed so far? I could read you every single class that has been um, uh, that has been gotten. I write them all down. We have a sovereign, a pugilist, an imperial, another pugilist, a medic, a harbinger, a highlander, a farmer, a war magus, a protector, a ronin, a night seeker, a highlander, and another ronin. That's what our current pool of units that we can draw from is. And we change them pretty much every dungeon. Or if we need to, we will change them immediately because goddamn, sometimes it can be rough. Imperial? Yep, we have an Imperial, BB guy. Firearms. I'm gonna give us an attack order. And that's it. I tell people, don't feel like you need to fill in for gaps, because we could just have several units. Because I want to make sure we use different people's characters, we will often get rid of one, and if we have another person of the same class in the back, we can keep them as a class and still get the experience of having, say, a Highlander or a Ronin at all times. Some classes can do different things, and it's very clear that sometimes you need up for damage, and other times you need versatility. Through to fire. I am very tempted to use fire on us. Actually, you know what? I shouldn't even fuck around with this. Wait, no, not that. Not that. I'm gonna waste TP if I do that. Alright, Haruka leveled up. Nice. And you know what? I think B staying here either. Yep, I don't think he's here. He did mention Bloody Veil. And if I remember correctly, if I go to his little thing he sent me about the roadmap for his character, he gave me a complete map of 0 to 99, and Bloody Veil was maxed out. So, you know what? Sure. I'm gonna say Bloody Veil can be maxed out. Folks busy on a Tuesday. Yep. I mean, real life happens. That's just the way shit goes sometimes. Nothing bad with it. The shocking thing is that I'm not busy this early in the morning on a Tuesday. Yes. Ready to come back from Mador Memorial Day. Yep, some jobs are backed up to hell and back because of that. I'm going to have to walk this anyways, but I want to fill up the map. Unemployed. Me too, man. Like, I'm also currently unemployed, and I would love to be able to have a job again. 800 money. I don't actually know if that was worth it or not. I'm gonna do that to the back row. Yep, we're already looking pretty okay. God, that... That march skill is so good! And wait, I need to walk through this two more- No, I don't, I don't, I forgot that I drew over here. Alright, so that is two squares in front of me is red. Looks like the one next to that is green, so I don't have to worry about that yet.
Now in front of me is another two squares of red. The amount you can just reach in is kind of nuts. All right, there are three squares in front of me that are red this time. It looks like there's a little break right there, so I'm going to make note of that. All right, in front of me is just a single random ass square of red. Okay, so I was wrong on that. There was no wall here. Two squares in front of me is red. Looks like it turns to the left over there. Or I get full HP, good. Game! I need you to stop! I need this game to chill the fuck out, man. I'm very tempted to run to get away from this fight. But I need the experience. I'm actually very lucky with the amount of times that they have not landed to sleep on like the back row and, and doomed us all. What sucks is that these things have a conditional, so I would normally be okay with them to get the conditional to get more money out of it. But we cannot activate their condition. Oh, fucking all. Yep, we can always get drunk and get the conditionals later. We just gotta survive that first time. We lost our fire buff and I do not want to... Ah. hope because I can't afford much else right now. <laughs> Fuck. God damn it, really? Son of a bitch. That fight, that one, that one mob is the most dangerous thing I've fought so far in this floor. And what sucks is if I don't get to the next shortcut, I have to fight my way all the all the way back here. <sighs> Alright, Motorm, 
We're gonna get you Monarch March 4. Piss. These are my last revives. hold off right now we have no encounters so i'm just gonna like hope that i am not gonna gamble that oh this is awful can i there's a chance this could be a recovery there's also a chance that this could just be like a, a forced fight and we die how's it how's it going jacko you already dead why not gamble because we're gonna get an instant game over then shining i do not want to have to fight my way back here again I just don't want to deal with that shit. What was happened? We fought the same encounter like three times in a row. And each time it gets us closer and closer to death, wasting more and more of our TP. Like that fight is just, oh my God. I might as well use this because I'm getting tired of that fucking encounter so much. I'm gonna walk a little bit and hope that Monarch March is gonna fill me up to the point that I feel comfortable getting that thing right there. Which already we're kind of there. It's kind of amazing how much you heal from that. All right, at this point, I am comfortable enough to say that if we die here, I will be angry, but we'll have to deal with that shit. As you make your way through the hot and humid forest, you find shade, the shade of a large tree loom, uh, looms before you. The ferns around you sway in the cool breeze. It sounds as though they are beckoning you to rest. However, Harker senses a disturbance in the air and raises their guard. With that in mind, you consider whether you should rest here or hurry on your way. I get this sick feeling. It's going to be like three of those trees. And that will just wipe me. So I'm going to have to say no. I'm gonna have to mark it for cleanup, yeah. We have to come back to it later. A reminder for me to go back to that because God damn, I do not wanna deal with that fight at all right now. Cause if it's three of those trees, any number of those trees, they can wipe us out so fast. <sighs> but if it gives me a heal off TP, we are instantly back in the fight and can go m longer. <sighs> I'm gonna be stupid and risk it. Having children to rest, uh, Mio decides to take a look around and see if it's safe. 
They slowly advanced, weapon at the ready. Suddenly, the tree hurled the coconut their way. Mio knocks Hokuna aside and launches the a, a counterattack. The tree sidesteps. Having evaded the attack, the tree stand up and direct its attention to you. Here, the tree is actually a monster. As you stand before the vicious tree, you hear intense rustling from in the bushes behind you, and another monster appears. Thankfully, you already had your weapons drawn. You quickly turn about face, and the monster backs off. You may have prevented the surprise attack, but you're still surrounded. You have to fight your way out. This is dangerous, but it's actually not as bad as the other ones. Unfortunately, we don't get our taunt, which is, like, awful. Lower their attack, please. I'm not going to go for ailments at all or, like, fire elemental stuff. We, just, we can't afford to. You will force. Give us guard order, because this is not going to be fun at all. And of course, they attack the back row first. Ugh. That's the kind of shit that I don't like that you can just randomly get sometimes. We already have a guard buff up, so go for an attack buff now and hope we can do this faster. <laughs> we got lucky there, thankfully. Now Kakaitis has a single heal and that is all we have to work with. I'm gonna do one more, I think, a guard order, and then I'm gonna do no more buffs this fight. <laughs> I just can't really afford to anymore. Harker provided a heal. Blast <laughs> of course you did. I think we can kill it. I think we can kill it. Thank God. Please tell me that provides a heal. Please. Or a uh, rest. Have you repelled the monster ambush? You keep your weapons drawn and wait to see if any more will appear. You then check your surroundings and slowly lower your weapons. It seems this place was actually a monster's hunting ground and was only made to look like a resting spot. If it hadn't been for Mio's warning, you would have stopped to rest and surely would have been ambushed. Your party thanks Mio, then quickly moves away from the area. So we got nothing from it then. Good to know. I mean, aside the experience, but I'd prefer getting TP. There's a take spot right there from the looks of it. Not so I was wrong about this line right here.
I'm gonna get it. Found clump sap. And by using the take skill, so it is a take spot. Good to know. Mint, clump sap, and cross seed. There's a single red tile right here. And the wall to the right of it. I'm gonna try and get to reach that shortcut over there real fast and badly. Thank fuck. All right. If that shortcut had gotten, thankfully this level just got a lot smaller without having to walk the entire way back. Moving through the dense fil uh, filtering jungle or flowering jungle, you haven't upon the same group of soldiers from before. Konnichiwa. Hello there. We've been sent directly from HQ. The tense looking soldier approaches you. Apologies, but I've been ordered not to allow anyone past you for the time being. Please make your way over to HQ if you'd like to know uh, to know more. And bows. I guess we're story locked. That's incredibly annoying, but... All right, I'm gonna explore as much as I can, then I'm gonna probably just area and throw it out of here. While exploring the forest, you pause to see water falling from above. You look up to find that it's not rain, uh, but water flowing from a broken tree branch. You recall that some of the trees in the forest uh, store a large amount of, the wa of water. This must be one of them. If you're thirsty, you might be able to take a break on one of the branches, uh, take a drink. Sure. You break off one of the nearby branches, and as you pull it down, the water begins to pour out. Thanks to this blessing from nature, you quench your thirst. Oh, now you give me that shit. 20 HP and TP. Feeling refreshed, you return to exploring the forest. I could have used that a while ago, game. Normal ass door here. Good to know. Make we gotta make it look nice. Look all fancy and presentable. Is this just a There nothing here? Yeah, there's nothing here. It's a panic room, I guess, maybe, but from what? Alright. Red tile. Alright, that means... We explored everything we could here every nook and cranny of the map aside this hellish room right here of three foes i didn't mark them actually how foolish of me and i remember correctly there were two chests right there as well reward for a hard challenge. Yeah, I my team currently can't do that, unfortunately. No matter how much I might have faith in my units, my units don't have faith in themselves, and it is kind of kicking our ass. We were blindsided. And someone got poisoned. I 
I'm gonna try Silver Thrust. Like, it's not gonna land at all, but I'm gonna at least try. And now Mio's gonna die. Okay, no, 37. That was not too bad then. Can't even atonement this because it's you didn't you don't have me as armor right now that's that's right fucking hell I should just not bother with silver thrust at all I'm gonna try it though just because like I want to see if it was even worth it to get it. So if it ever lands, it's very, very good damage. It's a big if, but if it does, then that's amazing. I did it three times in a row. Thirty-five uh, more steps of ward chime as well. Oh wait, you know what? That might be faster actually, just to go to that shortcut. Now we have no more warding bell. Hi, hi. Now come on. Tangling Ivy. Damn it. Not the one that I needed. And the encounter rate's going up shockingly fast now, really. But we got a preemptive attack on it, so let's see how this goes. I shouldn't try anything else but just attacking. But I'm going to try Silver Thrust, just because we've had good luck with it. Electricity. <laughs> Missed. Now we have the chance to just run away immediately, I think. Alright, no more of that, just attack it. Never mind. On first turn, it just runs away. All right. God, the encounter rate goes up so fucking fast. And we get this encounter. Well, thankfully, we're going to point that we can kill them without them ever poisoning us. No, don't go full auto. If I'm going to all attack, I just want to be able to back out of this just in case. Of that. Actually, we're kind of all right in HP still. I think I could survive one more of those. Good. Yeah. Back 
get me out of here. Now the scope can now be bought. That's just to temporarily give us access to that. I don't war care about that at all, really. Nectar, though, we need. Unfortunately, there's no better items for us right now that we can buy. Alright, what's going on? Red Moon Guild, you've returned. We called him, uh, We've called in an ally from Etria to assist with our investigation of the primitive jungle. Is the older version not, not the company? Yep, that is correct, Battle Knight. How's it going? Welcome. This is Etrian Odyssey Nexus from uh, the 3DS. It is not Etrian Odyssey 1, 2, or 3. Sorry. Those are the ones that I think are coming in on the remake that you could buy on, like, the PC and the like. Reports say this forest closely resembles the one in Etria, just as the lush woodlands here resembled those in Tharsis. I personally sent a group of soldiers to help this ally quickly map the area. I had hoped to avoid repeating the losses we suffered in the lush woodlands. <laughs> Package paid for preloaded for Switch. Now I wish I could actually, because so far I'm actually enjoying this game a lot. As much as it is just being cruel to me, I do kind of enjoy the game. And the one with the most classes, apparently. But I was too hasty. Our soldiers were met with a distraction and we lost track of our ally. They merely searched the area, but even now, we still haven't a clue as to her whereabouts. We simply cannot abandon her after she so willingly answered our call for help. Thus, I have issued a mission for any capable adventurer to search for her. Though it was an error on our part, I trust you have what it takes to resolve this matter. New mission been added. Alright. Well, then allow me to brief you on the details. We received a report that she was last seen on the B2F floor, along with accounts of an earth-shaking roar heard amongst the trees. Ah, excuse me. I was thinking about the adventurer who accepted this quest before you. He was a lone adventurer named Leo and wasn't allied with any group of any sort. Totally, he's also from here from Etria and knows our missing ally. Not wanting him to act alone, I took the precaution of enlisting some of our soldiers to, a to aid him in his exploration. I hope he's safe. Mm. Red Moon Guild, please confirm the safety as you carry out your mission. Your mission, yep. Full time game with almost no addictions anymore. And the bulk of my money goes to day one RPGs to stay happy. Awesome, man. Full time gamer, I hope you're doing well for yourself to be able to sustain that. And even more so, happy you're picking RPGs. They're awesome. Always love a good RPG. Oh, God. Young, so much. Ah. I gotta... I need to just push down on my desire to eat. I need to stream longer. No enemies to accept, but I can register monsters. And items. 50 items. 500 yen. Nice. They say... To have money or to, or be rich, you gotta save your money. You do. There was a big lesson in my life that I had to learn about just like saving any amount of money. Every time I make money, put some of it away. And with it, I was able to save enough money to be able to like do this whole thing for a, a, a little over a year. But now I'm in the search for a job because my savings have run their course. But at least for this one year, I played a lot of games I never would have, and I'm thoroughly proud of it. Matana. They say the map can also be um, uh, reported, but guess what? This map is not ready yet, and it's incomplete. I've heard that story before. I hope it works out for you. Thank you. I hope so as well. If not, I mean, I'm just going to vanish. 
but at least I'm gonna make sure people will understand what happened and just life comes first. Many will understand. Uh, uh, You're starting to raise the price, little lady. And I'm not a fan of that. Inflation should not be hitting this game that rapidly. We had the shortcut unlocked already. Oh, the remake has an auto map feature. That's kind of cool, but honestly, as weird as it sounds, this is also just for like to make sure people understand. This is my first Etrian Odyssey game. And the way I play games is the chat makes the teams decide where the skill points go, their weapons, and everything. So I don't control my team, but I control where we go and how badly we die. And. This game has an auto map feature as well. Like where we map, whatever we walk, it will put down like the green tiles, the walls and everything. It will. At the same time though, I kind of like just filling in the little details, putting the marker for foes on the map, putting in all the red tiles because God damn it, I missed one square right there. And I don't remember what that was. You know what? That's a wall right there. And I refuse to hear anyone say otherwise. But I like filling in all the details to like make my own map, my own little notes and everything. It's kind of cool. Never had it before in another game because this is my technically first dungeon crawler game. It's not, no, 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 it's a wall. You cannot convince me otherwise because I put a wall down there. It's a fucking wall now. That map is ruined now. Ruined after we do it all. Don't tell me that. Where was it? Uh, <laughs> it was here. You continue to explore B2, but you have uh, yet to find the missing woman. You check your map and find the center of this floor is the only place you have yet to look. It's possible she's somewhere around there. Map in hand, you continue your careful exploration of the labyrinth. Up here. Next to the room of hell. The room of Satan trying to kill us all. Where I walked in took one look around and said, not today, Satan. With three foes just staring you down from all sides for no fucking reason. It was this right here. I'm gonna delete this wall right here to say that's what it was. And I'm like, no, this should be a wall. Cause I, when I was, when this was back here, I did not step on the tile. So it should be a wall. The other wall. What I tell you guys, people are trying to fuck with me. They're trying to make me second guess myself because they're like being evil. No, 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 no. We do not do that here. We are responsible people. 